Hey y'all, I'm coming to you from the kitchen. And tonight I am doing something that I have prayed to the craft gods and goddesses that this works because if it doesn't, man, is my pride gonna be hurt. So I'm gonna wait for people to come in. So one, Rhode Island, to Rhode Island. Screw Rhode Island. Hey y'all, I'm coming to you from the kitchen. And tonight, we are going to blow your mind with hashtag Casper Coconuts. If you're in my Facebook group, we call it something else. If you'd like to know what that something else is, join our Facebook group, Show Me Show Van, and you'll know the secret term. But tonight it's called Casper Coconuts because you're going to want to reach out and grab them, but they're not there. So here we go. Y'all, I'm beyond excited. I'm jittery. I'm excited because I'm either going to soar or floppy, floppy, like just like flop now if it works it is gonna literally like blow your mind you're gonna be like what the what the what if it fails you're gonna be like unsubscribe <laughs> you're gonna just you're gonna be like seriously now look my wife told me babe why don't you try this beforehand and then do it tomorrow if you know it works? Like, I was like, no. Because if it works, I, like, I'm going to be over the moon. And if it doesn't work, I'm going to delete the hell out of this video. So, no. But if it works, the authenticity of the excitement has to be there. Plus a tattle on myself, and y'all will know if I did it the second time. So here goes, okay? Now for the sakeness of fastness and swiftness and all this stuff, I had to use different materials. and I, I, Y'all, I'm using all kinds of stuff because huh, I'm telling you, I can't even compose myself because I'm so excited and so jittery and so just boof. Get myself together. Okay. You're going to need a coffee mug. Okay? A coffee mug. Or a ceramic item of your choice. Okay? Make sure it's make sure it's good and deep. That's what she's doing. <clears throat> okay. So, you're going to need a coffee mug. Now, I didn't have time to glitter it and fancy dance it, but I think you're going to be so amazed, okay, that I'm going to keep it simple, but this is going to dazzle you. Like, I'm already dazzled in my mind. If it comes out like it is in my mind, okay, then I'm already dazzled. I think I should just leave it like this and just be like, bam, it's amazing, okay? All right, here we go. So, I'm first going to put, this is HTV, because I wanted to do this so bad tonight. I didn't have red sticky vinyl. All I had was red glitter vinyl. So this is, I mean, red glitter vinyl, duh. Red HTV. So I'm gonna use HTV and I'm gonna put it on the mug. But I'm not <coughs> gonna show you what it is just yet. But I think I may have overcut the other one. But we're gonna make it work maybe, hold on. Look, I'm not showing you yet. 
Ooh, so close. All right. So in order to put HTV on something that isn't heat or that isn't um, like a shirt or whatever, you can either use a mug press if you have a fancy mug press. But Kathy doesn't have one. So you can use really expensive tape. Okay, and you put your little doodaddy thing where you want it, aka right here, you just stick it, okay, and you can use the heat tape, whatever, okay, and then you get your heat gun. And make sure it's good and like tight. That's what she said. This might be the YouTube video where the F word flies if this works. Alright, so you make sure it's good and tight. Okay. Oh, sexy! Yes, girl! Alright, here we go. So then you're gonna put your little Tumbler or coffee mug. I'm gonna try and move you a little bit. Move you a little bit. Or let me let me just not move you. Whatever. Okay, there you go. Sorry, I'm trying to move my fancy camera system, aka my phone. All right. And you're gonna use your heat gun. And you're just gonna not touch that sticky thing. And you're just going to push. Okay. And your heat gun. It might be better if you use a um, popsicle stick. Okay. And just make sure that it's flush on the cup. Okay. And if you find that it needs some wiggle room, take your tape off and move it on down the road. Okay? And you just ease it on down. And then when you find that it is stuck on your cup, It's sticky, 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 sticky. Okay. You're going to lift your transfer tape a little bit. And you lift your... Lift it. And you just kind of wiggle it and move it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So this little piece... It needs to go down, get down on it, get down on it, okay, and make sure you like push down a little bit, okay, push down a little bit, see and if it forgot a little piece, you just put a little bit of heat, put a little bit of pressure, okay, and then if you see that it's not all the way down, you just put your heat gun, heat it up, push it down. Heat it up, push it down. Now look, I don't know if this is the expert way to do it, because I don't do this often, nor do I care to have the expert way to do it. I'm just doing this the fast way and the way that I know how to do it right now, because... I'm just trying to show you the cool stuff. So, just let me show you, okay? That ain't even the cool part. That's cool, but that ain't even the cool part. All right, let me cool it down. Make sure my stuff is cool now. Make sure my... Oh.
Okay. And now I'm just cooling it down so that it's good and stuck it. And some of the pieces I can kind of feel. And if they move, okay. All right. <coughs> move this over. All right. I want to make sure it's good and stuck. Oh my God, this is going to be so amazing. This is going to be so amazing. Okay? Huh. <sighs> so amazing. Literally. So amazing. All right. So, we just move it, make sure none of the pieces are moving, making sure none of my little pieces are moving. And you just gotta let it cool down for a second. Alright, Michelle Kristen, it says you have to go to the bathroom, but you can't leave. Hurry up, go pee while it's cooling down. Hurry up. God. Hurry up. Yes, I just called you out because you need a pee break. Sheesh, Louise. Everybody, we have to wait for Michelle because she has to go to the bathroom. <sighs> Michelle, let us know when you're back so we can continue the video. I'm really just pausing because we have to let it cool down. Okay. Now, I'm wondering if I should seal it before I paint it. I'm just going to paint it. I'm just going to paint it. Michelle, you're going to miss it. Hurry! <laughs> Poor Michelle. All right. All right, Michelle's back. All right, so now we're going to paint it. Okay? Black. Pitch black. Right? Just going to paint it. Pitch black. Here we go. Pitch black. I feel like I should seal it. What in the Sam Nut... A short commercial break. Hold on just a moment. It's still hot. Oh no. Darn it. We're gonna, I'm gonna have to let it cool down a little bit. <sighs> Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have to get this cold because it, it, it melted. Hold on. I have to, like, I have to get ice water. Give me a cup of ice water. Because it, it, it melted the brush. Shit, hockey mushrooms. It melted the brush. Dang it. Damn it. Damn it. Janet, I love you. 
All right. I need some ice water. I was so confused for a second. You really want ice in it? Um, well, I, yeah, because this is okay. super hot and I don't want to burn in the... Son of a bitch. I broke one now. <laughs> We're just having all kinds of debacles. But that's okay, because it's going to be so worth it. All right, that's okay. We're going to just shove it. Here, you want another one? All right, hold, please. No worries. So, how are y'all doing? The best part of waking up. People are like, don't put ice in it. It's going to crack it. Look, don't tell me how to run my life. Okay? Yeah, I don't know my life. Don't tell me what to do. You don't pay my bills. It ain't cracking it. Don't tell me how to run my life. And it didn't crack it, suckers. You need a bigger paintbrush. I need to get a different paintbrush. Because the first one melted. <laughs> so let me just get a different paintbrush. Because the first one shocked. You need um, to dry that? No, because the inside. There we go. But that I'm going to... Huh? That was how it's not wet. Nope, that's how it's not wet. Well, but they can see it. All right. Here we go. All right, so now I'm going to just continue painting it black like I had first started. Okay? So let me shake it up again. Shake up the paint. It's just, you know. Oop. Shoot. It's just black paint. Okay. We're just gonna just gonna black paint over it, okay? Okay, black black paint over it. Okay. To where we make the cup <laughs> pitch black. Okay. So just come on water. Just okay, so I'm just painting over it, pitch black. All right, now for those of you who have an airbrush, I would recommend you airbrushing because you won't have streaks. Okay, and I'm not going to do the handle so that I could keep holding the handle right now. So, please don't be like, you didn't do the handle, okay? Mind your business, which you didn't do the handle, okay? I know. I didn't do the handle. I'm aware. And I'm just going to paint this black and... I'm going to tell you a funny story about Luke and my softball team, okay, while I step to the side and dry this, and heat gun dry this. Now I'm going to step to the side and dry this because I don't want to reveal um, the next part of the design because it's a very cool um, part of the design um, that I don't want to show off yet. So if you just be patient, um, I just don't want to, I just don't want to show it because that's part of the surprise, the next part of the design. So just be patient and then you'll be here for the story and then, you know, whatever, okay? So just be patient. Okay? Alright. Now. 
<clears throat> here we go. I'm going to dry it down here, okay? I'm actually going to dry it on cool. All right. So, I'm a softball coach, right? And my son and my wife came to practice yesterday, okay, to surprise me. And it was such a nice surprise because they don't ever get to do that. My wife works grueling hours and she doesn't ever get to pick him up early from school. So for them to be able to come to see me coach, my girls, was quite the surprise. Okay. So my wife comes and out pops the car, my nugget. And my nugget has flowers and chips and a drink. And he is just tickled to death. Okay? So, he's all, like, super excited that he gets to watch me coach. And he's all excited that he gets to play with the girls, right? So, he goes out on the field, and he, you know, gets, you know, the ball. So it is now making me nervous because my kid is out there, five years old, no helmet, no pads, no protection, and these girls are fast pitch like lunatics. And they're like, uh oh, you know, like catching butterflies. So I'm like, listen up, pretty, pretty butterflies. My dude is out there. So y'all need to pay attention. Because my nuggy is out there, and he's my whole world. So while they were just fielding, and I was hitting to them, okay? So I'm going to put one more coat of paint. Okay, one more coat of paint. Because I want it to be like super black, okay? Like super mega black. Okay. So while I was, while I was hitting to the girls, okay? And they were just doing fielding drills. I didn't mind that he was out there. However, I was training a pitcher. And she's a fast pitcher. So I was taking him now off of the field. And he was pissed. Like he was so mad, right? And so he was just done with me. And so I said, Bubba, you can't play on the field because the girls are throwing the ball really hard and they're batting really hard. And you can't just, you can't be out there, baby. You're too tiny. And he said, but mom, and I said, no, son, no. And boy, he was just mad at the world, okay? Like, his whole world was just shot, shot in the shit, okay? So, lo and behold, he was just done, done with me. Well, I might have just brushed that too many times, but, all right, stop. All right, so... He was just done with life. So, I said, Nuggy, listen. Now, the next part I am going to do to the side. But this, I'm just cooling off. So, I said, Nuggy, listen. I want you to come over here and cheer with me. We're going to cheer. This really fun, cool cheer, right? And he says, okay, mama. So he stands by me and I said, we're going to taunt the pitcher. 
And I said, we're going to say, pitcher's got a big butt. Because Luke loves to say butt and booty. You know, he's five years old. So I said, we're going to teach. We're going to say, pitcher's got a big butt. And he said, but mom, I'm not supposed to say that. And I said, I know, baby. I know. But I want you to, to say it. It's okay. You could say it. Okay? Pitcher's got a big butt. Come on, Bubba. You could say it. You could say it. And he's like, but mama, I can't say that word. I said, baby, you say it. He goes, no, I don't. I said, yeah, you do, Bubba. It's fine. Mama's telling you you could say it, okay? Say it, baby. It's fine. For right now, you could say it. I'm giving you permission. You could say it. Pitcher's got a big butt. And so, boy, he's studying me, okay? And he's watching me. And I'm like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. In my back? Oh, Jesus in heaven. Did it go back on? Yeah. Are you sure? Do you see me? Oh my God. All of a sudden, it just like cut me out. <sighs> Look, I'm still on the same step. Nothing changed. Nothing changed. <coughs> oh my God. Literally, that was like a heart attack. Okay. So... He says, Mama, I can't say that. So he's studying me. He's looking me up and down. And I'm screaming it at my picture, right? Okay? Like, I'm screaming it. I'm like, Pitcher's got a big butt. And I'm like screaming it at it. And my girls, let me tell you something. My softball girls, they are amazing. I don't think I have ever had a softball team quite like these girls. These girls are phenomenal. I mean, they're existential. They show up to practice like ballers. They will eat your face off at practice. They are so good to each other. They look out for each other. They are amazing on the field. They are going to rock. Let me tell you something. You watch. I'm going to take these girls all the way to the championship. They're going to take me to the championship. They are unstoppable. These girls, you just watch. They're, y'all, you just watch, okay? Y'all are going to be hearing Chauvin's championship. I can't do anything because we're in a championship. That's what you're going to hear, okay? Because these girls are amazing. So anyway, I could brag on them all day. They're just, y'all, they're sweet. They're fun. They're like, they're kind. They're just, anyway, they're funny. Y'all, we laugh so much. They could be running like 16 times around the bases, and we still laugh at them. So anyway, all right. Enough about the girls. So, their high school, their high school varsity softball team. So, all of a sudden, Luke goes, All right, Mama. All right. I'm ready. I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to cheer. I'm going to do it. I said, Okay, baby. Okay. And he takes a big deep breath. And I mean like deep breath, right? Cats on the sideline. I'm right next to him and I'm like getting all excited, right? So, yo. Luke takes a big old deep breath. Five years old. I'm standing there with my little man in my arm cradled and he goes, you ready, Mom? I said, yeah, baby. He goes, 
bitches got a big butt. And I was like, what? He goes, T I knew I shouldn't have said that word. I knew, like he knew automatically he was in trouble and knew it. Like he knew it. He knew at that moment he was, he knew that. And he said, he, he said I knew it. I knew I shouldn't have said that word. I said, baby, picture, the picture has a big butt. Picture. She is the picture. The girl throwing the ball is the picture. He goes, I told you I wasn't allowed to say that word. I thought, now he's going to go to school and be like, my mama tricked me to saying bitches. And I knew I shouldn't have been saying bitches. But she she tricked me. Or he's going to go to school and be like, bitches got a big butt. Like, and be like, my mom said I could say it. <coughs> I was floored. I was like, oh my God. And I was so proud. I was like, yeah, Luke's going to cheer. And here's big. I'm like, what? What? He goes, I knew it. I mean, he knew it right off the bat. I knew it. But let me tell you this epic story of something that happened today that is literally going to bring tears to your eyes. It brought tears to our eyes. So, while I do this next step, I need to get this, like, big, like, wet spot to, like, get on with its life. Like, stop it already. Wet spot? I'm impatient. Seriously. Yeah. <laughs> so, let me just, um, so we have an operations engineer. Some other teams have a manager. But we have an operations engineer. Okay? Now follow the story with me. I'm going to use the name Indiana. Okay? As the student's name. So that I don't use the student's name. So her name is going to be Indiana, okay? And Indiana is the operations engineer on the team. Because they didn't have the heart to cut Indiana, okay? But Indiana just needs to be on a sports team for her transcripts. She is a brilliant, brilliant, okay, little girl who need not play fast pitch softball ever. And I mean ever. But Indiana decided that this year. She was going to come out and play for me. The meanest bitch that could ever possibly coach. Ever. And I don't keep people like just to be talking about. But Indiana struck my fancy so I casted her on my team now this next part of the cup I'm going to do underneath the table which is going to seem weird but for dramatic effect I don't want you to see it just yet okay so I'm going to be telling you the story okay 
to keep your attention while I do the the next part. But the next part of the cup, I'm also going to be putting another decal on the cup. Okay? But I'm not showing you the decal either. But it's also HTV. But I don't want to show you. So just listen to the story because it's sweet and heartwarming and it's a win-win. Okay? Here we go. Let me, let me, everybody good? Everybody can see? Me at least? All right. Let me make sure I'm putting this in the right place. Because once I stick it, that's all she wrote. I got one try to do this and not look like a damn fool. So, I'm going to need, I'm going to need to, and I cut it just a little, a little too big. But not too big to where I can't get it on. So, just bear with me. Okay? Alright. Alright, hold on. I gotta concentrate. I need your hands, Catherine. Hold on, because I'm, I'm doing... All right, hold that. Hold on. All right. Watch where, you, watch where you're pointing at. Hold the stick. Hold. I'm going to hold it like this. You hold the stick. Watch my thumb. Hold on, we're working on it. All right, so Indiana, okay, hold on, I I can't tell the story and pay attention because she's burning my leg off. Okay, I don't know what you want me to do, sweetie. Okay, this is what I need you to do. I need you to, there we go, perfect. Now I'll be able to talk to you. And you can't see nothing. All right, here we go. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Hold on. All right, so any that's what it needs to do. Okay. Nope. It needs to be close to the cup, just not my hand. Well, I I don't that. Okay. Push down. Wait, wait. All right, put it right there. All right, so Indiana comes today and says, okay, Coach. I think I want to try batting today. Right here, where my popsicle stick is. And I said, okay, baby. You want to try batting today? And she says, yes. Where my popsicle is. And she says, yes. I think I want to try to bat today. And I said, okay, Indiana. She said, I've never tried it before. I feel like today's the day. And I said, do what? I said, baby, you've never bat before ever? Nope. And I held the bat this weekend for the first time. And I feel like today's the day. I beg your pardon. So... So, you've never held a bat ever. Held. And you want a bat against a fast pitch pitcher. <clears throat> yes, ma'am. 
and I said, okay, let me, let me try this one more time. I said, I said, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna re, re talk you through this baby, because I want to make sure you know what you're, what you're saying. And she says, okay. And I said, you, you sure you don't want to just stick to operations engineer? Well, I'd like to at least try one time. And I said, well, you know what, Indiana? Let's do this. I thought, you know what? Indiana deserves a shot, right? She deserves a shot. Everybody deserves a try. She might totally suck, but you know what? She might totally fly, right? So my pitcher, who is a very well-seasoned, fast-pitch pitcher, looks at me and says, do what? I'm not pitching against Indiana. She says, coach, I'll kill him. I said, listen, you're going to pitch against him. The regular way. Fast pitch. You got it. She said, coach, come on. I said, you got it. So I walked Indiana over to the plate. I said, Indiana, stand right there, baby. And she goes, okay. I said, no, like get up on the plate. So she stands on home plate. I said, no, baby, no. So we teach her how to stand. We teach her, you know, how to grip the bat, how to hold the bat, how to swing, how to, you know, dig her heel in. I mean, dig her toe in, you know. We teach her, you know, just as much as we can in, you know, like three minutes. So Indiana's standing there. And my poor pitcher is petrified that she's going to kill this girl. And I'm petrified that she's going to kill this girl. So I'm thinking, well, okay, hold on. It worked. It worked. But this mm -hmm. covered that, but it worked. I think if I, but I want to see it like as it does it, but I, I think it worked. I think it worked. I think it worked. But I have to like, oh my God, I think it worked. I think, but I don't want, I don't. I know, I got to cool it down. Okay. Because I don't want to like. Cause I overheated it again. Okay. So my pitcher is scared to death. I'm scared to death. Everybody's scared to death. So she says, You sure, coach? I said, go for it. So I'm on the other side of Indiana. And all of a sudden, it starts pouring. I mean pouring. This poor little girl who has never held the bat, never swung a bat, never had a helmet on, never held a baseball glove on her hand like a hitting glove, ne never, ne and now while our number one fast pitch pitcher is pitching at her, it is now blazing rain in her face and we are all you got it indiana you got it you got it indiana i'm like all right indiana you got i mean it is like water is just dripping down my face i am soaked to the bone my girls are soaked to the bone in the field everybody is just drenched my pitcher pitches the first ball I mean, she, like, 
It was terrible. <coughs> I said, Indiana. Baby, I'm going to tell you when to swing, okay? <coughs> All right, coach. Man, she's holding that way back here. Holding that way back here. I'm like, hold it here. We like all, and then the girls, my girls. All right, come on, Indiana, you got it. Hold the bat, Indiana, you got this. My catcher, come on, Indiana, you got it. You're just a little, you're a second too soon, but you got this, Indiana. You're just a little second too soon, but you got it. Come on, you got it, Indiana, you got And y'all, my pitcher whew, threw another ball. Swung, missed. My pitcher whew, threw another ball. Swung, missed. The rain broke for a minute. I said, throw another one, Maddie. We weren't leaving till, till Indiana got a hold of that ball. Another ball, another ball. Swung, swung. The rain. Here came the rain again. We are soaked again. Rain is just drizzling. I mean, just, it is just storm. We are all just, I'm thinking, I don't even know how the girl is even swinging anymore because her arms got to be like jelly. But I'm thinking, it's her only day that she's going to hit probably. So I'm just going to work her until she can't move her arm tomorrow. Right? Okay. But, whew, miss, whew, miss. I'm like, man, what? Like, please, just, and I'm thinking, God, come on. Let her hit. Let her feel that bat meet that ball one time. Let her feel it meet it one time. I'm like, come on, my girls are screaming, like everybody's, I mean, cheering, everybody, we're all soaking wet, the girls are just dripping with water, Indiana's like, I got it, coach, this one, I'm like, you got it, baby, come on, she's now got this little, like, shimmy, and she's, like, ready, and she's, like, her confidence is, I'm like, you got it, come on, Indiana, you got it, come on, and all of a sudden, Y'all, look, I got goosebumps. I'm not even kidding you. All of a sudden, my pitcher nails. She, my pitcher was nailing it today, okay? Her arm is going to be like jello tomorrow. My pitcher nails this pitch, and Indiana hits a pop fly out of the park, okay? Like a foul ball. But she hit it out of the park. And we erupt like freaking Sammy Sosa just hit his freaking 99th home run in like a day. We were like, yeah, Indiana, Indiana, whoa, Indiana. We were like, seriously, couldn't get our shit together. We were like, Indiana, Indiana. So she's just standing there. And so I'm like, wait a minute. I'm like, Indiana, run! And she's like, oh, yeah. And so she takes off running. And she like, where, Coach, where? I'm like, run, Indiana, run to first, run. They can't get the ball because you hit it out of the park. And she's like, I did. And I'm like, yes, Indiana, it's a home run, run. And she freaking High tails it, okay? So the catcher, I'm like, throw the ball to first after she goes to first. She's like, okay. So, like, and I mean to tell you clearly, Indiana is circling the bases, okay? So she is running. Now she's at second. She's like, home run, home run. Like, I mean, literally just freaking nailing the bags, okay? So she comes in, she the the catcher is standing there, but like not, you know, she's like, oh, I'm missing. She's like, a home run, a home run. The girls give her high fives. The girls give her all kind of like, you know, 
camaraderie, like, yeah, yeah, you know, ass pass, whatever. And then she goes, coach, I did it. Yes. And she leans into me and she gives me this giant freaking hug and hugs me and just starts weeping. And she goes, I actually accomplished something in a sport. I hit a home run. This is definitely something for my resume. And I thought, little things like that. She, all she needed was just that one boost. It was, we were soaking wet. We were drenched to the bone. She's no more gonna ever play in a high stakes game than the man in the moon. But she nailed it. And tomorrow, that's gonna be the talk of the school is how Indiana nailed one out of the park. And it's so amazing because those girls know that Indiana isn't the ball player that they are. Indiana isn't the ball player that they've been seasoned to be. But they stood there in the field ready as if she was going to knock it back to them. They stood there. You got this, Indiana. That's right. Put your foot in a little bit harder. Pull that bat up. You got it. That's way to swing. That was a good swing, Indiana. And never let up. Not, oh, God. Do we have to, do, coach, this is such a waste of time. Not one girl bitched and complained. Not one girl rolled her eyes. Not one girl gave me attitude or sass or not one. But they all stood there in ready position with their gloves like a team and cheered that girl on like she was freaking Kat Osterman that just hit the Olympics. And I was so proud of that girl that I couldn't even see straight. And it was just, when I tell you about victories in, in life and victories in, in teaching and victories in, in sportsmanship, man, you can't get any better than those girls. You just can't. All right. You ready to see? All right, I need some ice. Need some ice water. Water! Get the link ready. You're going to want to drop it when I say, drop it like it's hot, but don't drop it yet. Hold on. Oh, I get hold on. Sorry. <laughs> Got a little, got a little excited. We're gonna move you back over here. Cause I'm gonna need room to, I'm gonna need room to cheer. I need room to cheer. Sorry. Hey, okay, hold on. Ban it, ban it, ban it. Oh wait, y'all wanna play Name That Tune on my kazoo? Hold on. Ban it, ban it, ban it, Make it go. All right. Ready, suckers? Let's go, Indiana. Let's go. Let's go, Indiana. Let's go. All right. I need a flashlight. Look for the other one. Flashlight. <clears throat> 
I need one that works tonight. The black one. All right. Have you been drinking? Yup. In my new mug, suckers. All right. Oh, sexy. Oh my God. Hit the lights. Oh my God. Y'all. I'm getting so excited. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hit that too. Hit that too. What's it? It's. Oh. Can you just please do the instructions that I've asked of you? Hit the bedroom first. <laughs> not that one yet. It's not charged. Okay, wait. I gotta charge it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh. Oh my God. Y'all, shut up. Just shut your faces. Oh, shish kebabs. You ready? Oh my god, I wish I could play music on YouTube because this would be so much better with the soundtrack. Okay? Ready? Ready? Hit the lights! Oh, Rocky! Oh, look at that sexy thing. Let's do the time warp again. Let's do the time warp again. Light. It's just a jump to the left. But wait. There's more. That vinyl. It's just glow-in-the-dark vinyl. That's not even the fun part. Watch this, suckers. Wait, is it wrong? Oh, wait. I said watch this, suckers. Oh, please. Please work. It's all cold. It was on cold. <clears throat> ha! Ha! It works! Oh my god! Shut up! Look! <laughs> it works! It works! Look! It's the lips! Do you see them? It's the sexy lips! What? Do you see them? So when you put your coffee in your cup, you see the sexy lips. I should have put Rocky on one side and the lips on the other. I get it. I know. Whatever. But do you see the lips behind Rocky? That's not Rocky. That's Frank. I know. I'm making all kinds of mistakes. But do you see it? Right? Lights! Let's do the time warp again. It's just a jump to the left. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Lights. And then a he goes to the right. I should have put the lips to the right. Right? I should have put the lips to the right. Okay? Drop it like it's hot. Okay, so listen. The paint is black to clear. Loud and clear. Okay, so I did make the mistake and put the lips on the wrong spot. Okay? So I should have put the lips behind, like on the another side or, or whatever. But I put the lips behind them. So you can't really tell the definition of the lips, but whatever. I was anxious and excited and I didn't think it through. Whatever. You live and you learn. You learn through my mistake. You're welcome. But this is what it is. Okay. It is thermochromatic paint from Atlantic Chemical Engineering. And it's black 
to colorless, meaning black to clear. The reason why I freaked out way in the beginning of the video was because when I went to put the first stroke of the black on with the paintbrush, the mug was warm. So when I went to stroke it on, it was going on, but I was like, why is it not? And I was like, oh my God, it's gonna give it away because the cup was turning clear and not being painted black. So I had to chill the cup out. You had to chill the cup out. You had to chill <laughs> it out <clears throat> so that you wouldn't know the secret. But the secret was that it's black to clear. So you could do things like mm, spooky eyes or cute little, message. cute little secret sexy messages like Say you want to do the hippity dippity at night and you don't want to, you know, like whatever. You can leave your little bang bang cup out on the out on the um counter and it could be like, I wanna do the hokey pokey. I wanna do the Yankee Doodle Dandy tonight. And they or one could say, I have a headache, don't even try it. So, when your partner wakes up in the morning, the best part of waking up is finding out if you're getting any. You can have messages like, if you want some, take out the trash. And then they can fill their cup up and be like, oh, I need to take out the trash. Or, you're eating here tonight. No eating here tonight. You on a diet. And then they know. Womp womp. They did something wrong. So literally. This could be like. You're up all night to get lucky. So. If you want some. Get some paint. So I'm just saying. That's amazing. You could probably. Put it over anything. And then it turns. Like I'm just saying. It's amazing. So it could be like whatever. Let's try it on something else just to see if it turns out. What can we put it on? I don't know. Take your top off. I guess not. I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, and it's non toxic. So you can put it on your cup so you can drink it. Can you seal it? Yeah. Let's try it. Let's see if you can seal it. Let's see. Stop, sunshine. Oh, Rocky. <coughs> yes. Yes, you can seal it. And I would recommend sealing it before you epoxy it. I know you can't epoxy it. So, yes. Ta-da! Okay. So, there you go. Um, I don't know where I put this because everything is got covered in glitter. Um, so, there's the link. For it. You can get it in a two ounce or a six ounce. Um, <coughs> and a little goes a long way. Watch Seriously. You're about to touch it. I'm about to touch it. Don't touch it. Because now it's wet again. Um, a little goes a long way. <coughs> I found this out from someone who shared it with me on the down low, on the slick. Um, so, super excited. Um... I would imagine it turns anything from black to colorless. Give me a nut. Give me a can of nuts. What? Give me the can of nuts. This? Yeah. We're going to see if the can of nuts... We can paint the can of nuts, and then it turns it. Okay. We're just seeing what it turns. I mean, I imagine you could turn anything. I mean... 
Nem ám. Um, give me a for instance. A tumbler. No. I know, like, you can, but here was the issue that somebody brought up. A stainless steel tumbler doesn't get hot from the outside because it's double walled. So a ceramic mug is what gets hot when you put something in it, like soup or coffee. So it's best to use a ceramic mug or a ceramic bowl because if you use a stainless steel cup, the only way that it'll get hot or you'll see the transition is if you heat gun it or if you leave it in the sun. Make sense? But they do have ceramic tumblers because here's one right here. So here's the ceramic tumbler. Dollar Tree. No, Rouse's. So they do have ceramic tumblers. Um, but, um, they, uh, but they, stainless steel, you won't have, it, it's double walled. So, if that makes sense. Um, so, but I would imagine, I mean, let's just paint the peanut guy and see. I mean, I would imagine if we paint him. I almost got you a clear coffee mug. A clear one? Mm -hmm. Why clear? Mm -hmm. See if it would work. Well, I would reckon it would. I'm gonna let that dry for a second, but um, you okay? Just choking on my nuts. Um, you all right, babe? Um, and they do have colors. They have like blue to black, blue to green, blue to whatever. But what's cool is the black to clear because you can put hidden messages and hidden whatever. So, um, that's what's cool about it to me is, um, the, the color... The black to clear allows you to do the hidden messages. So. <laughs> Baby, all right? Yep. Same effect. You can put it on anything. And it changes from black to clear. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah. It goes on all. Huh? You need something to drink? You need me to highlight you? No. How was that? <coughs> Sorry. I'm okay. You sure? Uh-huh. Need salt? Hmm? Need salt? No. So, the peanut guy. <coughs> James. Um, so. Does it change? Mm hmm. <coughs> so. Um. So, all those things work. Um. If you have any other questions about it, you can ask in our group. You can ask me in Messenger. You can ask on the YouTube. So. Um, that was my, um, hashtag Casper Coconuts, um, because you see why I called it Casper? Because it disappears, because you want to go out and touch it, but it disappears. Um, so, ha ha ha, Casper Coconuts. If you want to know what else I called it, go join our Facebook group. Um, so, but thanks y'all so much. Y'all have a great night. Be good to everybody. If y'all need anything, please feel free to message me, um, and we'll see y'all soon. 
I hope it was worth the wait. I hope you enjoyed the stories. Um, Y'all, please pray for my girls. I'm going to run the life out of them tomorrow. So they've got a lot going for them. Um, so thanks so much. Y'all have a good one. Bye, y'all.